Hmm, check this out. Yes, let's comment. Okay. O M G that depth of field. Yes. Uh, no, no, no. Um, hmm. Oh, wait, wait. Wow. I love planes too. Yes. Yeah, I, I, I like them. I do. I, I like them. I like planes. Planes are good. No, 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 no. Wait. OMG. That saturation in the clouds, though. Yes. Send. What's up, guys? Wanted to pop on and make a quick video today about disingenuous or fake Instagram comments. Oh, let me tell you what actually what prompted this video. I woke up this morning and the first thing is made myself some coffee and I did my morning routine, all that jazz. And then I sat down, you know, was going through the notifications on Instagram and I came across one, one comment that had said, Hi, I like this on a, on a picture that I posted. It said, Hi, I like this. How are you? And I thought, Well, hey, I'm doing great, you know? And, and I wanted to reply and, and say hello. But I thought, let me, let me just go check this dude's profile and see what he's about, you know? And then lo and behold, I go there, check his profile out. Damn, it's a bot. So after checking out this dude's profile and, you know, figuring out that this is either a bot or a guy's using an algorithm to comment on, on everybody's stuff, um, I kind of felt a little deceived, you know, like it was, you know, not, not heartfelt deceived, but just a little bit, like I was duped, I was tricked. You know, somebody was reaching out to say hello and, and you know, try to, try to be friendly and lo and behold, it was, it was just a big ploy to, to get me to comment, follow and, and like his stuff. No comment for you. Now, I, I totally get why you might want to use a bot or like use algorithms, right? To, to, to boost your stats, boost your numbers. You know, maybe you are like just in for, for the marketing. You're trying to build a brand. Um, you know, maybe you're, you're becoming or you want to become an influencer, you know, so you, you gotta, you gotta artificially pump your stats up and, and stuff like that. You're not worried about connection, you know, but if you're an artist and you're a creator and you kind of want more people to see your work, okay, or you want that exposure and, and you're thinking that, you know, by doing this, you're giving your work more exposure, I'm, I'm going to actually think that this is a bad route to take, you know, I, just because it, it comes across as pretty spammy. So maybe your goals are different than my goals and that's totally cool. Uh, but I think if you're there for connection and trying to get your work seen, uh, you know, doing the whole bot thing, it, again, my opinion, um, is, is the wrong way to go. And, you know, to, to give a little bit of, of reasoning behind that, um, I've been on Instagram maybe about a year or so now. And there's been people who have reached out and I've reached out to that we've started conversations about a year ago that I still have continuing dialogue with every couple days, you know, so much so that I would almost consider these people my friends. You know, now granted, it, it's a geographical issue, okay? Some people are in other countries and whatnot, uh, but that doesn't matter. You know, we, we share some some awesome conversations and, I, you know, I, I think it's a, a, cool, a cool way to connect. And, and even more so, there's been local people that, that I still, to this day, I go out and I shoot with that I've met through Instagram. You know, these are cool people that, if you reach out or they reach out, you know, you can actually create a friendship uh, that you wouldn't have had before. What are these real people you speak of? Now, this video was not meant to be a giant gripe about Instagram bots, although I kind of did a little bit of that. But the whole purpose, you know, behind the video was that I wanted to make a suggestion. How often are we reaching out to other creatives, you know, leaving like a genuine comment Maybe there's a photo that you saw and, and you really dig this photo. You know, why not 
just drop them a couple words, you know, a couple genuine words and say, hey, I really dig this photo because X, Y, Z. You know, I know a lot of times we can be kind of like passive and, and just watch, you know, watch all this cool stuff. We check out their pictures and, and, and whatnot. But how often are we, we actually acknowledging these people? My guess is, you know, we could probably do that a little bit more than, than we do now. And, or maybe not, you know, maybe, maybe you're comment me comicsters and, and you just, you know, that, that's all you do. And, and you're just, that's what you do. You know, in this case, don't worry about it. You know, ignore, ignore said video. Uh, but for the rest of us, myself included, you know, I mean, making maybe a little bit more of an effort to, to jump on shooting somebody a DM and, and just saying, Hey, I really dig your work because pff, whatever, you know, whatever that reason may be. Um, so maybe today just reach out to one person and, and leave a comment, you know, leave a, a cool comment to maybe you'll brighten their day. I have really no way to end this video other than, um, uh, 